it. I bought a caddy van. <laughs> if only. <laughs> so yes, as you can see, I have bought a Peugeot Partner. It is a 2004. Reason being, if you have a unit and you've got loads of shit, you need something that you don't care about or don't care about as much and you can just throw in the back. So that is why I bought this little van. It is a 2004 Peugeot Partner. It is a two litre HDI. Uh, it's got 116,000 miles on it. And the best thing about it is I got it super cheap. We do have some stuff to get on with today though. Um, I, am few, I am filming this after I've done the work and I have had a month off, so the camera work is a little bit under par. But you know me, I'm not very good with all the uh, camera stuff, so you get to see me do some work. Um, what do we do? We change the head unit. Uh, we did the window regulator because the driver's side window didn't work. Um, and what else did we do? I think that was it. Um, I was supposed to tint the rear windows, but that didn't go to, go to plan, so I didn't put that in. Um, so yeah, it's just a little, I haven't filmed anything for a month, so bang this out. We've got a massive, massive update coming soon because things are very different here at the shed. The fleet is completely changed. Um, I'm super excited for it. Some of you might not like it, but hey ho, here we go. I want to say a massive thank you and welcome to all the new subscribers and obviously a thank you to all the existing uh, subscribers. I love you all and I appreciate every single one of you. Um, let's keep smashing that goal to 1,000 subscribers this year, boys. Pa, 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 pa. But yeah, so massive welcome to all the new subscribers and obviously thank you for subscribing. Thank you to all of you that have already subscribed. I love it. Um, so yeah, let's get on with today's video. Let's get on with to getting on with the van. So the first thing we're going to address in the van is this head unit. Now, hang on, I've got about four in here. So it did come with this one. Um, problem with this one was every time you turn the van on and off, uh, you'd have to reset it and you'd have to find the radio station again and that button falls out, so that's super gay. So I went and found this original unit from a Bilingo and now it does, because it's not the original one from the van, it does this, so you turn it on. So it uh, triggers the security thing and beeps at you. Now I know you can get these coded in, but uh, I'm not going to do that. So I did go to the local scrappers. Oh, watch my shifty thing. I found this bad boy, Alpine Bluetooth or 20 pound or. So we're going to slap that in. As much as I like the, uh, the factory style, uh, I do enjoy listening to my stuff on Bluetooth. So. We're gonna try and do this one-handed, boys. Watch the fingernails come off. I didn't stuff. Oh yes, I stuff, didn't stuff this in on purpose. So I knew this bad boy would be coming back out. So we're gonna do this whole install one-handed. Improve my YouTube skills. Um, so this is not a tutorial. This is me getting shit done. Oh, it's a bit shaky today tell that I've been off for a while. Come on, baby. The French make things so much harder than it needs to be. I've got them two plugs off. I'm gonna have to use one of these little adapters to make the aerial a little bit longer. Right. Now I plug your loom into your existing ones. Noise one, brother. USB audio, haha, <laughs> Bluetooth audio. Right, we just shove that in there. Right then. Safe to say that works. Next thing is, if you can see. These are the window switches. Passenger side works. Driver side, not so much yo. Time to fix yo.
would just go down like a normal window. So then we can slot the glass in. Let's have a look. Hey, there we go. Nice. Right, so um, before, so you saw that work. Before I put the glass in, I'm just gonna make a template because I want to um, tint the front windows. Don't ask me why, because I'm a fucking bad boy. But yeah, so I'm gonna just write to the window quick and then I'm done to wrap this up. Right then boys, the tin kind of got fucked in the rain, but, but, watch this. Got a working window. That's good. So let's put this back together and we'll move on to the next thing. thing left to do on the van let's give her a quick clean because I was going to try and clean Annie today but there's a car in front of it and it's got flat battery so that won't be happening so let's give the van a bit of a wash deserved clean. It wasn't much but I found these um, water jugs at the container and they hold plenty of water and you managed to get I managed to wash the whole van using one of them so chuffed with that. Um, I was like I said supposed to wash Annie but I'm sick of flat batteries to be honest. I'm gonna go buy I'm gonna go buy one of them um, doodars you know those uh, what are they called? I think they're called Neo Boost or Sync Boost. There's little zip zip, boom. You know those little charger things. So, because I'm fucking fed up with all these flat batteries and I've got no jump leads. I tried to jump it off the van with some bullshit little piss wire jump leads. Didn't work. So, I think they're a hundred pound. I'm gonna go buy one of them because I'm fed up with flat batteries to be honest. But yeah. So, <sighs> that is gonna be the end of this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed the van vid. Um, like I said, massive update soon um, to do with the channel and cars and things. So stay tuned for that. Um, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in very soon. <laughs>